would have to say that I've learnt the most in my 10 years here at this football club, transcend what happens on the field. Yes, it was magnificent to win a premiership. Yes, it was magnificent to even put on the Guernsey for the first time back in 2005, which was actually Nathan Buckley's 250th game for this football club. Yes, it was magnificent to play in those years of 2010, 2011, where we were virtually unstoppable. But the thing that I hold greatest to my heart are my values, which are also congruent with the values of the Collingwood Football Club. And the number one most important value that this football club has is community. Is community. Back during the Great Depression, the Collingwood Football Club opened up its doors to the poorest of people. It gave them hope. It gave them shelter. It gave them food. And now in 2014, we find ourselves in a very interesting time, not only for this football club, but for this whole world. The landscape is changing. And I know that if the Collingwood Football Club is to go to the next level as a football club, it must stand on the right side of history. One thing that I have learnt in my journey that I will hold to my heart for the rest of my life is that I know what side of history I stand on and I'm so grateful that the Collingwood Football Club has allowed me to define my character and also find my the true meaning of my true name which is Heritier Dezebelis Luzevi Lumumba which means the prince the one who will have the last laugh and is gifted thank you what you just said is one of the most insanely idiotic things I have ever heard. At no point in your rambling, incoherent response were you even close to anything that could be considered a rational thought. Everyone in this room is now dumber for having listened to it. I award you no points, and may God have mercy on your soul.